By 2009, Les Mis had sold more than 50 million tickets around the globe. With its 25th anniversary looming, a new production was unveiled, which broke audience records on tour across the UK. But no one could have predicted that the next chapter of this remarkable story would come from outside the world of theatre altogether. Susan Boyle and Britain's Got Talent was one of those extraordinary things, the thunderbolt from left field to mixed metaphors that uh, changed the way everybody thought about the show. The funny thing is there's this belief that uh, the show's been running 25 years, but there's never been a hit from it. Uh, but there has now, uh, with I Dreamed a Dream. I dreamed a dream in time gone by Did you? Did you? No. I dream that love will never die. Within hours, within days, people were talking about it everywhere in the world. It, it became number one news. Perhaps you're one of the more than five million people who've seen the world's newest singing sensation online, Susan Boyle, from the hit UK show Britain's Got Talent. When dreams are made and used and wasted. Not many people had connected it with Les Miserables, and the fact everywhere they kept saying, this is I Dreamed a Dream from Les Miserables. And that had a profound effect, and indeed hugely increased um, the appetite of audiences that possibly hadn't seen it to come and see it live on stage. <laughs> 